Hi everybody, Stephen Flagg here, and welcome back to Flagcraft, where we are going to go refine some fucking oil. Yeah. Oh yeah. First, let's go uh, just quickly run up there and see how well the filler was doing. Since last episode, all I really did was stand right here. <laughs> I went to the kitchen, I grabbed myself a coffee. Shin? Sips? Oh, okay, it looks like, yeah, we are getting quite a hole dug there. Now let's see how the, uh, yeah, let's, uh, refill a little bit in there. Machine's making me a little laggy. Okay, and then we'll get to the other one, refill some coal, because we don't want it to run out before it ends. Now, on the server, I built this three or four times, and I always made sure I was close by while it was running, uh, but near the end, before the server shut down, God, it just kept getting stolen from me. People kept coming in and stealing it. So I'd have to make a call. Someone would come along and they'd they'd uh, set the ground back to, uh, like a, a few days to when it was still there. And it was uh, it was a pain in the ass. I like this. This is my world. There's nobody else around, so nobody's going to steal anything from me. So you guys as excited as I am to see this oil go? Oil refinery. That is the first step to creating fuel. You know, even if we don't get uh, to go to the moon, I'm pretty sure you need fuel for jetpacks and things. We could make a fucking jet. We could be fucking James Bond, guys. Look at how awesome this looks. Oh, this is going to be so cool. Now, the, the only thing that's going to suck is if it doesn't suck all this oil up. And I have to keep moving it. Okay, so, uh, continuing on. The Sterling Engines. We need to... Uh, now, generally, you really should have three Sterling engines on this. Uh, I only made four. Or six, I'm sorry. I've got two running that over there. I've got two here and two here. I really didn't feel like making any more Sterling engines. And, uh, and it, the truth of the matter is I actually forgot. But running with two should be fine. We're going to see how, how it works. So we got the coal in there. Okay, so, <laughs> this is exciting, okay, here it goes, ready or not, start pumping your oil. I don't see any oil. Oh, I didn't put any coal into you, that's why, sorry. Uh, I need to steal a bit of coal from you guys. There we go. That, sh that should work. There it is! Look at that! It's filling up! It's filling up in the open tank. Oh yeah. Okay, it's looking good. She's filling up. Sorry, I'm just... I'm, I'm a stickler for make keeping things even. There we go. Okay, so the tank is starting to fill up now with oil. What do we got in there now? Four thousand, five about five thousand microbytes. Oh yeah, look at that. I have a feeling we could very likely run out of room. Well, okay, if that happens, we'll turn everything off. We'll set everything. Okay, but everybody, you got you all want to see the fuel starting to get consumed, do you not? So what we're gonna do is turn on these pumps. Now we're going to have to reach underneath. Oh, we need a lever there. We'll turn on that redstone engine. Uh-oh. Oh no. No, I need the stone one. Okay, and then we turn on that redstone engine. So that should be sucking it into the refinery, and it's coming out as fuel! Sorry if that got loud. Ladies and gentlemen, we now are now making fucking fuel. Oil comes out, fuel comes in. Oh, this is fucking stew, fucking pendus, and look at all this oil, too. We could make an entire oil field of this. Look at how fast that's filling up.
Yeah, see, it's, it's, uh, what color is it? It's purple, red, purple. Pur uh, oh, purple, red. It means it's really not moving at the intensity it could be. If we had one more Sterling engine, I could probably throw it on top. Yeah, see, look how it's, ra it's just raring through the power of there. But it's doing what we need. It's, it is now creating lots of fuel. Um, okay, um, I'm getting a little nervous here about the size of this, but the bonus of these ta the old tanks that you would use, like say the tanks that I used to create uh, the refinery, they stay separate because you see they've got all the lines on them, like measurement lines, but these open blocks tanks, they're amazing just for this. Look at that shit. So now I can make this tank double the size. And well, about at least that high. Now I'm not afraid that uh, I'm going to run out of oil. Look at that. Oh, look, it even moves in there. Oh, that's fucking cool. So what I'll wind up doing in the meantime, uh, in between episodes, is I will grab some more, uh, some more tanks. And I'll bring the tanks down here. Some more coal as well. Maybe I'll get a new Sterling engine and put it on top of there. So this is one of the primary things I am going to need when it comes to Galacticraft. I will need fuel. There are several other things we're going to need. I haven't looked into them yet. Uh, I'm wondering right now what it would take to actually transport all of this fuel back to where my Starfleet headquarters is going to be. So let's just walk in a straight line right along here. It's really far. 170... Get out of my way, sand. Yeah, it's... It's really far. But what we could possibly do is run it underground. Look at this. I love it over here. Hey, how you doing, Wanderer? Uh, some more iron leggings. Yeah, don't need them. Okay, so let's head back. Let's see how the filler's doing. You can tell you're getting close because, uh, here, I'm going to let go of forward. Oh, okay, I stopped. Letting go. Oh. Usually the leg builds up as soon as you get close. Unless it's run out of coal. Just keep your ears open, you'll hear it. Yeah. Hear it? Now, the, the only... Uh, I've probably mentioned this already. The downside to using a filler is you do lose any resources it comes across. But... I don't think there's anything just in this mountainside that I could have done without. Now, uh, the, the plan is actually, it's going to come lower, but you're going to be able to take stairs down and into the, uh, into the world of uh, Starfleet Command. We've got a couple of Guardians uh, watching Flag Estates. We may have to put a couple of guardians up there to watch Starfleet Command. Hmm. We'll think about that. Hey, if, if, if you know uh, any uh, popular Minecraft YouTubers you'd like to, you'd like me to put up as gargoyles, basically, to watch over my Starfleet Command, let me know down in the comments. I better eat again. So, I needed some more open blocks tanks. I don't have any in here. Oh, oh, yeah, I went raiding again. Look, I found some more uh, things. A paintbrush. I found a hang glider. Uh, I went, if we look at my waypoints, 
you can see I've got stairs, the abandoned fortress, uh, and then all these stairs. Now these are the stairs that go down to the lower levels. I didn't do a lot of looting or a lot of killing while I was down there, but I did light up the areas quite a bit, so it's going to make it a little, a little more exciting the next time we go down there. And I have waypoints as to where the stairs are. So uh, we need to make some tanks. So I can't remember, and I just made some about 20 minutes ago. Tanks. No. Tank. Tank. There it is. Uh, it is... Oh, that's right. It's obsidian and glass panes. That's right. So, I need... Water be me obsidian. Uh, probably in rare. Look at that. And I need some glass pane. Do I have that in here? I got some in there. Probably gonna have to make more. Let's uh, maybe leave some. Okay, so uh, glass pane is made by just putting glass in here like... Uh, not like that. Like this, I believe. Yes. So I got 16 glass pane. 60, no, I got a whole shitload of glass pane, sorry. Now let's do this, and then we go, what we got, 24, uh, okay that's all we're going to need, I guess, <laughs> let's go, oh it's monstery out there, I don't want to go out if it's monstery out, now this is uh, one of the things I wanted to test too, I'm not very far away from the pumps, but I want to make sure that the pumps are, in fact, still working when I go away. Now, generally, the filler, if you're not directly in the area, the filler's not really working. So uh, to get this to finish off, I am going to have to stay right here, like maybe do some uh, gardening or something for a while off camera. But in fact, it is still, like, it's 60. It should have burned a little more coal than that. Uh, but anyway, yeah, let's go back. We'll, we'll check that out again later. Uh, drop a couple of torches here, Flag. Wait, what the fuck? You fuck off. Yeah, you just, go ahead. Shoot at me, I don't care. I'm going to my oil. Black gold. Texas tea. Well, the first thing you know, old Flag's a millionaire. The kin folk said, Flag, move away from there. Said, get off the fucking island. There's some things you gotta see. We got oil in the desert. We got giant fucking trees. Oh, look at that. It's just loading right up very quickly. And there's no sign of it stopping yet. That is a good thing. So what we want to do is... Wow, it's not really... Not really filling the fuel up very much, is it? So let's uh, triple. Let's triple the size of this. Mainly because I can't nerd pull up there without it. Ooh. Okay, there we go. This is what I want. And this is going to hurt. Woo! Okay, so we are pumping the oil. The oil is now pumping directly through. It is going through this refinery and being turned into fuel, which we will then use to power a rocket ship. I'm going to have to make a NASA workbench, uh, that reminds me. Uh, but anyway, yeah, uh, that was a, a whole shitload of stuff we just did today. And uh, we went through it really quickly. Uh, I'm going to go back home and wait for the filler to fill out. And then uh, when you come back, we'll figure out what materials we're going to use to make the to make Starfleet Headquarters. Uh, so anyway, guys, uh, thanks for coming around. I'm Stephen Flagg, and uh, check you later.